all right guys they're playing illusion top lane in season 13 and i'm gonna teach you guys exactly on how you can play this champion top so what you want to run is pda presence alacrity cut the grass of biscuits and cosmic we also have uh the starter with the red buff there you go check this out man we're playing against a castio actually kind of weird though we're playing in like an off meta top laner but we're also playing against a mother off meta top laner like Cassio and Lucian are both champions that work in top lane very well, you know, in the past. But it's weird to like see this, you know, right now. It's very unusual to see a Cassio being played in lane. All right. So the plan is that we're going to be spamming my Q pretty much across the place. I'll try and like uh, hit him like max range with my Qs each time. Nice. Dropping this down. I could technically get a kill right now, though. She has TP. Yeah, she's gonna get back. Alright. We shove this out. I think that she's probably gonna TP back. Drop this down. You know, the thing is, like, uh, Caster can farm very safely. Um, however, we can just dash in if you like. And pre-6, is it's gonna... Um, it's not gonna be a big deal, since she doesn't really have abilities that can stop me. Um, but after she reaches level 6, she can technically ult me and kill me very quickly, so... Nice... Wait a second. I think I can probably get more kills than this guy. Didn't hit the power aggro. Nice. He's struggling to farm. Shove this out again. There is a chance that Fiego might show up at some point. For instance, right now, actually. I wonder if I can beat him. Cassio might be on the way as well. Oh, apparently he took the camp. And now he went back to the jungle. Sure. I think that she's still here. Yeah, she is. I wonder if I can get a kill now. I'm very happy I have biscuits this game. It really helps. Hit another one. Think I might be able to get another passive auto in. Yeah, like I thought. Great. Let's grab this one. Actually, like, it's kind of difficult to do. I'm just going to head back here. So, yeah, let the first item we're going to go with is... I've been thinking about the new items, actually. A little bit. Let's go Berserk Greaves. Something seems too good to be true. You see, what I've been thinking about is going for... Um, it's going to sound absolutely ridiculous, but... What I have been thinking about is Spear of Shoujin on ranged champs, but it really uh, it really depends. I think Spear of Shoujin on, a on, on an ADC like Lucian would fit perfectly, but it depends. Like, Lucian uses a lot. I want to hear, like, you guys' opinion about this. What do you guys about Spear of Shoujin on ADC, like, like Lucian, for example? Just curious to what you guys say. But yeah, I'm thinking about trying this out. Or we can just go for Crack and Slayer. That's also fine. Oh man, he walked back into my autos. Dude. That's a mistake right there, buddy. 
That's a huge mistake. All right, let's get some uh, autos on the passive. There's something about this skin. I don't I can quite say it, but like, I don't know. It's satisfying. I think it's the auto attacks. There you go. All right. So we have multiple choice. We can go for the new item. We can also go for the on hit build. I'm thinking more about the on hit build, to be honest. So I'm thinking about blade, actually. I think I'm going to go with blade. I think I will. Um, because it, ma it it fits pretty well together with the passive. You know, you get like multiple autos off uh, with the combination, like the combo from Lucian. I, I think that old hit build is going to shine here. We're going to, we're going to use it. All right. So yeah, I think it's going to be like Blade, Kraken Slayer, or something like that. Shove this out again. Oh, bro, the auto attacks feel so satisfying on the skin. So now we got to be a little more, uh, a little bit more careful since if we dash into Casio, she can basically pop in ultimate. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Hmm. All right, let's see how this is going to work. We get free autos either way. Push it out again. I still have like two potions remaining, so we can use these. And here we go again. She's dead. See you later, buddy. Hey, Jor, another gift. Hey, thanks, man. <laughs> so many gifts. Honestly, I lost count of how, how many you gifted right now. Nice. Wait, what? You kidding, bro. <laughs> did he just flash? Actually, I think he did, right? Huh. I think he flashed. He came out of, like, absolutely nowhere. Or he must have ulted. Nah, I don't think so. Yeah, let's grab my um, let's grab my blue trinket. That's gonna help. All right, here we go. Yo, she's building catalyst. Oh, she's going for rod of ages build. I think. We've got Kane in position. I think our ultimate is back up. Yep. Her ultimate was about to be casted. You, you could hear the sound, but... Probably it was some cooldown before. I don't know. It's very late. Nice. Got it. Oh, she used it. Oh, oh, that must be so tilting for this guy. Ooh, that feels pretty bad for him. Nice.
You can't really do anything. I wonder if I can actually get a kill on Casio. Need like a bit more though. Nice. Seven seconds on my Q, or I mean on my E, never mind. Yeah, see you later, buddy. See you later. I'm abusing Lucian. No problem. Ranged champions and top always feel so... Uh, it feels satisfying. And I know in the back of my mind, I know that everybody hates playing against ranged champions. And it is. It's the way it is. Like, I hate it too, man. If I play... Um, if I play a bruiser in top, it doesn't matter what it is. There are some champions in top... Like, you know, think about Lucian, think about Vayne, think about Ash. You know, mobile champs or, or champs that have perma slow, they're just not fun to play against, right? Playing playing them yourself feels a lot of fun. You know, just, just annoying people with it. Ooh, how fed is this guy? Ooh, he's got five kills too. Yeah, okay. <laughs> oh man, she gale pushed up to me before. All right, you know we're we're destroying top lane really hard, but now we have to face up like two people who are actually wrecking bottom. So we have to change our plans a little bit. We have like an on hit build. Obviously, we don't beat a, uh, a Caitlyn then if there's a Yumi on top of this. Tell me she's... Oh man, she was legit standing there. She didn't kite. He was standing there like a turret, bro. Getting three kills there. What? Alright. We'll find out what we can do. Come on, don't reset. Let's push this out. Uh, we need to get our uh, we need to get our hands on Drakes at some point now. Let's get this camp as well. We really need the team to like group up for this. Nice, they're going for it. I'm gonna see if I can kill Cassio though. Oh, he messed up. Got him. She is never hitting ultimates on me, ever. I don't want to rush the turret for no reason. I'm going to keep it. I'll make sure to use it as much as I can. Wait. Eh. Feels bad, man. Second time I get wrecked by this guy. You know, I didn't... I don't mind facing off Yone or facing off anyone. Really, I don't care. Um, but a, F a Fiego is a problem. <clears throat> I don't mind seeing Yone, but this guy does a lot of damage. I can't 1v1 this guy. Like, unless I uh, see him first, I won't be able to kill him. Let's go for crit.
Yo, we gotta prevent like dying to this Viego. Seriously, we should. I wanna go top though. There you go. Okay, let's see if we can kill Cassio. We're gonna be farming this guy for a while. Still gotta be careful though, not to use too much mana since we, yeah, sure we have like biscuits and presents, but um we still run out of mana really quickly. Like really fast. So we gotta be a little careful with how we use the mana. I think Caitlyn's on the way top. So we can't really stay here. Yeah, they also use the plants. Yep. We need like a thousand gold left for the Kraken Slayer, and that will give us a lot of damage. Back top. I'm just gonna farm the wave out. I'm not gonna fight Caitlyn. I'll just stand there. It ain't the gray life here. It's what crawls out of it. <laughs> All right. Let's go for the jungle camps as well. Another wave is coming here. I'll take that first. And then we go for this camp right here. Just gotta hurry up though, because Kaylin's pressuring mid. I think we can get kills on her. There's another camp here. Again, I just want to be efficient and take anything I can find. Anything, really. Also, my ultimate cost me like 100 mana, so I gotta be careful with how I spend it. They're going for this? They are? Yeah, he's doing it. I'm gonna let my. I'm gonna let Jim walk in first, obviously. I won't take that risk. Drake spawns in 30. Twenty-five seconds. Also, Cassio's in bottom. My teammates are already on dragon, so I'm gonna quickly get my item. There you go. Let's pad down there. You know what I would appreciate? I hope we can get blue buff. Uh quick question. How about the new Nevery Quick Blitz on Lucian? Um I don't really know. Because you need a, I believe you need a minimum of 60% crit. We don't have that yet, so. Yeah, my teammates are getting dragon, so we're farming this out here. Dude, come on. They changed their range from these camps. I notice it. Dude, come on. This reset on these jungle camps, dude. How are you supposed to grieve when the thing you mourn comes back? Nice. Yep, there's uh, Diego here. I think that's about enough. No. 100 HP. Hmm. There's absolutely nothing to farm on the map, though. 
I want to sustain back up from something, but there's, there's nothing here. Wait. Okay, this will do. I think my next item is going to be... Um, it's very situational, but I'm thinking about going crit. We can also go Wit's End. Um, but since Cassio is, is kind of inting, it, we don't really need it. Alright, let's go here. Or maybe we can also go for a Bloodthirster would also be a good idea. Okay, then it's also power farming like crazy. Like pretty much the whole game straight. I'm really considering, 100% considering, going for uh, Bloodthirster, actually. Uh, just so we can have sustain. Then again, like, the only thing I'm also missing is a little bit of um, ability hay so I can spam everything, but it's not needed. No need it. Hmm. Yeah. All right. All right. All right. Fine. <laughs> all right. Time to go back. <laughs> yeah. Or what we can also do is we can take a sense reaper since it provides me pretty much everything I need except. Um. It does not provide me the lifesteal. But yeah, I think we're just going to go Sentry for that. That's going to be a good solution. Let's go. I think I might actually go for this jungle camp right here. Nice. Okay, here we go. Hmm. We can go for the... Yeah, we're just going to keep on doing the same process. Um, by doing what we're doing now, we're already ahead in the game, as you can see. There you go. We're like already ahead in the game. We're out leveling Kaylin already. And the longer we do this, um, the stronger we're going to be in the end. So. Oh, apparently she's going to go for it. Oh, I think my teammate walked away. Ah, are you kidding, dude? I want to replay that stuff, but I think that my teammate was up there and he just walked away. I think. This Caitlyn just kept running, dude. I uh, I cast my ultimate to ensure that Caitlyn wasn't going to chase me down, and she still did it. Ooh. This is the first time she get a kill. We need that dragon. Uh, quick question. Hey, Dave, did you see the vein with the heart stealer build? What do you think about it? Eh, I can't really tell if I would recommend it to anyone, to be honest. I don't know. Like, sure, the item is great, but it's got some... Um, even though it makes you tanky, you're obviously missing damage. Like, you can, do, you can hit, like, 250 damage every, like, 30 seconds, but... The item still lacks damage. You know what I mean? Maybe I'm super wrong. Maybe we can give it a try. I'm definitely open to try this out. Sure. Dude, I am stuck. Legit stuck. And Caitlyn does like so much damage. Hmm. 
We're like so far ahead, but like Caitlyn is just that strong. She just outranges me. Alright. No one there. People never really change. I need to believe that. Hmm. Take another wave. I don't like the fact that Caitlyn has a Yumi this game. It's really preventing me from being able to kill Caitlyn. Like the whole game straight so far. Because we are stronger than her. We are out leveling Caitlyn. We're straight up stronger than her currently. Again. This guy doesn't die. Like that's the point. He's outranging us. So that's that's it's fine. Like we we can just dash into Caitlyn and we can try and burst her, but Yumi always heals up, so I can also go for anti-healing. Hmm. I'm uh, I'm considering like going for anti-healing at some point in this game just to prevent Yumi from healing. Like, this Kaylin has been an issue straight up since the start of this game, actually. Like, since uh, 10 minutes in, she, was, she starts swapping lanes, and she's been a pain ever since. Just annoying, dude. Alright. I'll grab my Essence Reaper. We need, like, five man group up. Really? Wait, my ADC has... I didn't notice until now, actually, but my ADC has, like, one item at, like, 30 minutes. Uh, that's also a reason. You know, my AD carry is a cannon at the moment, dude. This guy has no farm at all. This Caitlyn, I just we just can't deal with them. We don't have to. We just you, you know you know how to fix to this. You just go as five man, but it never happens. Oh, 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 that's like one auto attack, bro. That Caitlyn is too fed right now, way too fed. Frustration. This Caitlyn is so fed right now. So fed. She right clicks once and does like a thousand damage. She just runs up to people right now. Huh. Wait, he popped me W? Oh, what's that? Oh, that Corky damage is ridiculous. Again, like Caitlyn is just doing Caitlyn things. Oh, I should have baited. I don't know. This game is very one-sided. Um, in fact, they have like one guy who's even went AFK, but it's just very one-sided. Caitlyn is just right-clicking people for decades at this point. Ah, this is legit anti the dude. Since since like the start of the game, like Caitlyn's just been free roaming the game, and like no no one no one tries and cat like catch it. She's always just solo farming everything. There's no team fights at all since like the last 30 minutes. This guy's free roaming all the time. Hmm.
All right. We have enough crit right now. I'm going to go BF sword. Let's go. Looks like no place for me today. Some call it magic. Sucks, man. I hate Yumi. I hate Yumi when I play against her when someone has like 15 kills. It's annoying to deal with. This whole game we have a lead, but we just can't use it. Go for the jungle camps. Volcane's gonna go with that. Get that one. I'm pretty sure. Wait, wait. The the only way for us to like uh, beat the Kaylin right now is by having Corky up here. And Corky is pretty late. Dude, I'm like stuck up with this wave here. Ah, this game is so stupid. It is so stupid. We we went from like such an incredible laning phase to being like legit super one versus thirty. Like, it is so annoying. Ah. How upsetting. Sucks, man. It is what it is. Hey, the way to solution top. Thanks much for watching. And I'll see you next time. Peace.